Have fun. Okay. Be careful. Okay, I will. Don't pass any snowplows. I won't pass snowplows. Love you. Love you too. See you. All right. See you later. What do you think, Fluffs? I gotta go, okay? This is Mark, and uh, we are getting ready to go on a surf adventure. I say we, it's really just me and it's you. Hoping to meet some friends up in the Duluth area. Um, we're gonna head up to Lake Superior. It's at least a five hour drive in good conditions, so probably six or seven in this stuff. And uh, I'm really stoked it's gonna be a great adventure. I'm glad that I'm bringing you along, and uh, we'll see how this goes. No going back now, this is it. Extremely helpful. I recommend general service. I would really prefer to be bringing a friend along with me, but sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. Um, there's only a handful of guys that I know that really are up for this kind of stuff, and this time every one of them had a reason they couldn't go. Not an excuse, because every one of them wanted to go. Uh, anyway, I'm thankful for this. I'm thankful for these adventures. I'm going to count on God to protect me. Not to be overly dramatic, but this is definitely the most dangerous part of this trip is getting there. <laughs> All right. So long, everybody. Love you. We got uh, 268 miles to go. I'm averaging 40 miles an hour. I'm stuck on a snow plow. It's going to be a long night. I better focus on driving. I'm, I'm thankful for the rumble strips because from time to time you can't really tell where you are on the highway. But uh, I can still feel the rumble strips through the snow. That's good. One last stop for gas. We're just about to the hotel. It's definitely gotten worse. That surf has got to be building nicely. This is going to be something else. We got 10 miles to go, and uh, I can't see a thing. It's gotten pretty darn heavy. Wind is howling. So this is definitely uh, the worst of it for this drive. I'm thankful that nothing has happened so far. We can make it another 10 miles. We're, uh, we're good to go. All right, we'll see you at the hotel. All right, made it. <laughs> so I think I forgot my hat. <laughs> Not a good day to do that. Maybe I could buy one here in a hotel. Anyway, uh, I'm just gonna get my stuff, get in there and get to bed. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. All right, this is it, it's go time. Getting some wax on my board. Um, thinking about where I wanna surf. There's some friends out there. Uh, I'm sure I'll run into them, so that's cool. Put a stronger leash on. Last thing I want is to have a leash break out there. Your body's already getting kind of slow, and then you're swimming. This one's thicker, but it's older, so I don't know which one's worse. I need a new string, too. Don't fail me today. Oh, that'll wake you up. <laughs> this is it. Oh. So to be honest, I'm straight out a little bit scared. I just saw the waves rolling through 
in a spot that I've driven by before and I've never seen it look like that and it's it's intimidating the whole ice in the water I saw a lot of ice chunks um, don't know if anybody else is gonna be out I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna handle this I don't have a firm plan <laughs> I love it but it's kind of a love-hate relationship because I'm a little nervous at the same time. There's, uh, there's a few guys out. I'm excited. I'm going to get suited up. I've already got the camera out there, so right now they should be catching some waves. Hopefully we pick something up. Hopefully I've got it pointed right. Uh, anyway, you can tell I get excited, I'll start blabbering. <laughs> okay, we'll see you out there. What's up, y'all? Fresh from Costa Rica. Back from Costa Rica, fresh. <laughs> He's trying to talk himself into this contest. <laughs> uh, so I caught a few. Some of the other guys got some. I hope I have the camera oriented right. But uh, the reason I had to get out, I, I couldn't turn my head. And uh, like it's not sealing here. And last time I got flushed. You got some chunks there, bro. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, there's another guy out there. I'm like, he's gotta be. 30 pounds of ice on them. Dang, you know? man. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna get in here and warm up. All right, so I'm just gonna sit here and uh, warm my feet, melt for, for 30 minutes or so, and then figure out whether to go out here again or maybe it's time to go to another spot.
All right, that's uh, round number two. Super, super fun. I'm gonna try to thaw out. With a little luck, we'll get one more in. We'll see you then. Okay, got the camera on the tripod. New spot. Hopefully I pick up some of the folks out there. There's some rippers and uh, a lot of good people. Always fun crowd here in the Midwest. No aggro attitudes. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See you out there. Oh, now I gotta, I gotta get some heat on my toes though real quick. That one real smart strategically. <laughs> This is the last one, so I try to time it right. session three and uh, gonna go get the camera it was a lot of fun gotta make this fast because I am getting cold <laughs> so this was an awesome day awesome adventure all the way around I hope to give you a good idea 
of what the Great Lakes surfing experience is like in February. Uh, I had a blast surfing with the people that were in the lineup. And uh, I just want to close it out by saying thank you, God. All good things are from Him. And uh, I love to give Him the glory. All right, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.